Welcome back to Ta-da! 3D Printing. Today I'm going to be printing a motorized boat. The file and profile is Boat Model 010 and it's on Maker World by Van Dragon. And to complete the print, I purchased this components kit from Bamboo Labs, the Boat Model Components 010. Because this 3MF file is already set up for my printer, I don't have to make any adjustments on the infill. This is already set up to have the center of gravity correct and it's going to print without me adjusting anything. But there are directions if you need to adjust this for your printer. There are four different build plates for this model and the first one, when I click slice, it's going to be two hours and 42 minutes. And I'll be running this on the Bamboo X1 Carbon with AMS with Overture in white and black. The Lifesaver took one hour and one minute and I used Overture in silk red and white. For the steering wheel, I used Polymaker Pro PLA in brown to give it a wood look and it took about 11 minutes. For the main part of the boat, the dock part, I used CC Tree PLA Olive Green for the top half. And the same Overture Silk PLA that I had used for the lightsaver, I used for the bottom section of the boat. And this is how they look all together, all four pieces. Now I can grab the components kit, and there is a QR code that takes you to that model if you scan that as well. I was surprised to see that there really is only one part. And this doesn't have any electronics, it's just a wind-up motor. This is what the finished boat looks like all put together and the motor just easily attaches. It just slips on the back right there. It just kind of latches on the back and it doesn't feel like it's gonna easily fall off. It looks like this is a pretty good design. The wind-up motor seems like it's gonna work, so let's go ahead and test it out in the water. And I just realized that the steering wheel actually does spin. Of course, it's not functional, but it is kind of a nice detail. First thing, I wanna see if this floats without touching the motor. And it does. It's not like the benchies that flip over and float upside down. It floats just fine. Now I want to try it with the wind up motor. And once you have it all wound up, you can hold the prop in place to help it not just start spinning in air. And it does seem like there is more movement with the motor. It is moving faster. I wanted to try it again when the water was a little bit more still because I feel like it's kind of the motor keeps turning to one side. So I wanted to keep this as straight as possible but it does just turn and then it wants to spin in circles and even when I try to just pull it and straighten it back out again it seems like it immediately starts turning again but it's still pretty fun I probably should have tied a string to it because it likes to just float out into the middle of the pool I do try it a couple more times to see if I can get it to go straight and both times they just start to spin but it is pretty cool to have a floating boat let me know your thoughts if I missed anything Thanks for watching.